I used to do cooking for a living. Uh, like many other people, I got laid off during the pandemic. Uh, come December, I was kind of bored sitting around the house, so I just started uh, cooking for a small group in the neighborhood, family and friends mostly. Uh, as time went on, they told their friends and neighbors and had a couple more people add on, and next thing I knew, it was a, a big thing, so I had to get a location to make it more legitimate. Uh, and uh, found this place here in Lingolstown. Uh, we rent the kitchen, we don't own this property. Uh, and we have, it's a web-based group. Everybody orders online, they place their orders. I go to the stores the morning of, I bring everything here, produce, and it goes out to them over a three hour window from three to six. It's kind of destiny, I guess, kind of a blessing in disguise. Two or dash, uh, why, why soup, you know, why, you know, soup guy? <laughs> uh, well, it, I, it's something I, uh, that's a good question, actually. Uh, originally, it was just, like I said, something simple just to do just for fun, you know, and, uh, but I was also really good at it. That's kind of what I mastered at, at the Capitol building. That's what I was really renowned for. Uh, so originally, that's all I started doing was just soups. And then when I moved to this location, and we got our licensing and everything, I decided to start doing the entrees and stuff, just to kind of, especially during summertime, I was a little, little concerned about how soup was going to go over summer. So I started doing entrees, and they started going very well as well. So I kept them on. But uh, soup. Uh, Mostly because it's, it's good for the soul. Everybody loves soup, you know? I mean, it's just one of those foods where uh, everybody likes it, you know? Can't go wrong with soup. It's comfort food, you know? The ultimate comfort food. Well, we have a rotational menu. We, we put them out monthly. Uh, we usually atypically do an entree and two soups every day. Business is going very well. We have a, a website, Soup Guy PA dot com where the orders are placed we also have a facebook community group uh, all the comments and feedback from customers are on there if anybody's interested in looking uh don't take my word for it <laughs> uh that business is going very well it's we started with a group of what 50 people and we have about 1400 now in the group uh that's as far as we know then people outside of that place orders as well.